Hey y'all, welcome back to the channel. I'm Mike with Fowler Family Farm. I got a real quick video for y'all today. Uh, try to keep this probably under 10 minutes. I'm feeding the chickens out real quick. So I don't know if y'all have noticed, I only did two videos last week. I'll probably only do two videos this week and probably for the next month, I'll be doing maybe two, to, one to two videos a week. My dad's been in the hospital for going on three weeks now. The first week he got there, they actually moved him. Uh, they actually moved him to like a skilled nursing center and things just got a little worse. So they moved him back to the hospital and then he's been in the hospital ever since. So last night was probably our worst night at the hospital kind of gave us a pretty good scare. So I just don't have as much time on the farm. I'm at the hospital a lot. So what you get is what you get, I guess, for now. Um, like I said, hopefully I can do two videos a week. Um, it'll probably be about a month long. And then maybe we can get back to uh, three, three videos a week after a certain time frame. So I've been leaving these girls in as much as possible as well. Hold on, nope, 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 you get back. That is dangerous. <laughs> Having the goats come in here, they'll just attack this feed. So, like last video, I just kinda... Okay, so I definitely need to water these girls and boys today. Yeah, sneaky, aren't I? Oh, come on, Millie. Come on, Millie. Yeah, y'all thought y'all were gonna get in there. By the way, York is sold. Oh, and so is Nuka, right here together. I have sold, I'm pretty sure I've sold both of them. Uh, they're going to go to another farm just as lawnmowers and pets. They don't have a buck. They're not going to breed them. So that's going to work out perfect for both parties. Um, let's go in and start the water and water these. Actually, I have to do it with the bucket because my water hose broke. So I have a short water hose now. So yeah, the dialysis is what's keeping my dad alive right now. And he's just having some really bad days and some really good days. Some days are great, some days are terrible. His dementia is getting the best of him. Yeah, so his dementia is definitely getting the best of him right now. Uh, like this morning when I, I got off work and went and visited with him for about an hour with him and my mom. And he had no idea who I was, which I'm okay with that, that's, that's fine. I need to know who he is. He doesn't necessarily, you know, in his condition, it's it's more important that I know who he is really than, than he know me, so that's okay. Uh, he does remember Braxton and Brendan really well, and he remembers Tanya really well at times. I mean, he forgets all of us really, but sometimes Mima, uh, his wife, my mom, he thinks is just a nurse, but then at times he knows exactly who she is, so it just comes and goes. <clears throat> But his health, his actual organs and stuff, and his health, they're deteriorating as well, uh, we believe. Uh, but I'm just giving you all a heads up. That's mainly what this video is about. Like I said, it's going to be quick and short because i got to get back up to the hospital anyway. So probably two videos a week, y'all. All right, let's carry this water into the white chickens. I'm going to do that off camera. I'll be right back, y'all. All right, empty bucket, happy chickens, bunch of happy goats. Bunch of fat goats, they're so fat. Just lay down right there. Silas and Elena are both with them right now, so that's good. So this here has been postponed, if y'all remember this video. Crandall was gracious enough to give us uh, some high tunnel material. These chickens are doing good. I need to move everything. I need to move all this this way. Give them some new area. Uh, four, five chickens cannot keep up with this big of a chicken net. 
chicken pen. I mean, you can see the grass is just overgrown now. They can't eat enough of the grass. Hello, Oreo. Your baby's scratching her head. Triplets are doing good, y'all. Oreo can definitely keep up with triplets. Yeah, and this guy's out, by the way. I don't know how he got out. Yeah, none of them are ready, Chip. Don't even think about it. They're not even close. Oh, really, York? You're gonna act like you're interested? I'm really shocked that Megatron hasn't gotten out. I don't know how Chip got out. I think he just jumped. But he just now found the girls. He's been out for two hours and just now found the girls. So he's not interested in York at all. See, this is the one that hasn't been pregnant three years now. <laughs> okay, y'all, let's uh, wrap this video up. I'm gonna take y'all up to the shop real quick and kind of show you what I started for part of my house build. Um, I know I don't show you a whole lot of the house build stuff, but I'm gonna take you in there and show you the before and after, I guess, really. I'll have Brennan put the goats up here in a minute when I leave, so. Mainly Megatron, I mean, uh, mainly Chip. So, we'll head to the shop and I'll show you this real quick. Okay, so, by the way, this is the top, so just so we know. Actually, you know what, just let me stand it up, maybe. No, I'm gonna leave it down, because it's heavy. <laughs> This is all plywood, three quarter inch plywood. And then like this right here are the trim pieces. It's not the greatest wood, but it's all gonna be painted. So it doesn't have to be the best wood out there. So the face trim is also three quarter inch, solid wood though, not plywood. Uh, you can see here, I've covered a lot of that. I haven't sanded it yet. Well, some of it I have, just to kind of get it, a look at it. Um, I've filled in all the nail holes. I have not filled in the screw holes here, but I will. Actually, this will all get trim as well, the same trim. But this is a bookcase, and it's going to go under the living room TV. I'll take you in there and show you real quick. But it's actually 10 feet long, because here's another piece. This is the front side. You see I haven't done the trim yet. I haven't even done the trim on this one. So I've only gotten so far with this, kind of like the garden. I've only done so much of the garden. I guess you gave up, not interested. Yeah, he's not interested in the girls right now. He doesn't want anything to do with them. <laughs> if anything, he just thinks they're a nuisance probably right now. That's how bucks are. They only wanna be around those girls a certain time of year. So I wanna take you inside and show you where I'm using this bookcase entertainment center, slash entertainment center, I guess. Well, hello. <laughs> so this is where I'm putting the entertainment center bookcase. It's gonna go 10 feet long. We're getting rid of this. We're gonna sell this. But it's gonna go here. Okay, so that's where the entertainment center is gonna go. Um, probably, hopefully get that done within the next week or two, somewhere in there. Uh, I should have had it done already, but you know, life, you know, things happen. So I've been at the hospital, like I said, I've been at the hospital a lot. I've got a, y'all, y'all are amazing people. I got a good group of people that follow me. About 1,500 of y'all watch pretty consistently, pretty regularly, and I appreciate it, y'all. Y'all are awesome. I know y'all are willing to pray for our family and our farm, so we're asking for prayers. If you don't mind, just give us a prayer each night or maybe in the morning when you wake up, mainly for my dad uh, and that our farm stays healthy and things are so good right now on the farm. We're kind of blessed, but I know I'm going to have to give my time sparingly right now on the farm. so. Pray for us, keep us in your thoughts. Uh, hopefully some good news will come here in the next week or so. All right, thank you all for watching the video and we'll probably see you back here next Monday. We're gonna skip a Saturday video, so. All right, y'all, thanks for watching. We'll see you in the next video. Remember, At the do the good. Family farm. Come on.